And now and I just walked out. <laughs> Wearing the same thing. Oh, my God. oh this is fuck. This is really embarrassing. Lose rock paper whoever loses rock, paper, scissors is the biggest loser this entire trip. Okay, bitch. <laughs> rock, rock, paper, paper scissors, scissors, shoot. <laughs> We're saying how disgusting your computer screen was. <sighs> I know, it's really gross. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, look at that thing. It literally looks like porn. No, we literally came to see these guys and now they're leaving. Okay, bye guys. <laughs> oh, it's so sad. Three, two, one, now. You went a foot high. <laughs> Check this out. I know I'm out of breath, but it's my first time on a swing in a while. What? I know. That's me. I made it. <laughs> Holy shit, guys. We've been driving around. The show starts at 730. Um, and we do, we're like, oh, it's 630. But it hasn't changed. The clock's been at 636 forever. It's actually 736. <laughs> um, oh, 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 sorry, sorry. Hey, fuck. Yes, David! Answer both questions on our sweatshirt. He's still talking about this I'm one. I'm getting in the character of a method actor. What the fuck's going on? Give me some time. <laughs> All right, here we go. <clears throat> oh, it's on! <laughs> That's my one line. It comes in at an hour and ten minutes into the movie. It's worth it. Thank you. Is there somebody up in this area? My dad told me, whatever you do, do it to the best of your ability. So whether you're a garbage man, whether you're uh, a news anchor, whether you're a teacher, do it the best you can do, and that's that's all you need. And then also the other the other day before I. Uh, Oh, I want, to, I want to talk about this because this is really funny. I got to host um, the Teen Choice Awards the other day. Woo! Yeah. And I was super nervous. Well, first of all, I, I got to meet my idol, Robert Downey Jr., which was insane. They put, they put my trailer right across from his. Um, so I had people on my team wait outside my trailer waiting for him to come so they could come and flag me so I could come meet him. And I was like, and, they were, and then five hours later, they're like, he's here, he's finally here. He pulled up in this beautiful fancy car and I'm coming out and I'm like I'm gonna fucking say the f I'm gonna fucking say hi to him so hard right now <laughs> and I was so excited I, I walk out of my trailer and literally this is uh, my voice goes hi <laughs> who are you tell me everything and I go I am I am I like the like a little girl I, I am your biggest fan I love you so much and I go I don't know what else to say I'm so nervous and I went right back and I shook his hand and like when he shakes his hand when he shakes your hand He's like a superhero. He's like, he's actually Tony Stark in real life. So it was like, I, first of all, I felt like I was in that movie, which is pretty badass. And he was staring into my eyes and I wanted to cry. And I went right back into my, uh, into my trailer and I just like, I melted in my seat. I was like, I can't believe that happened. And then I remember 40 minutes later, the show was starting and he probably thought I was a complete idiot, like a lunatic, because I couldn't find my words. And then 30, 40 minutes later, the show was starting, and I was the host, so I was opening up the entire thing, and I come on the stage, and I see him sitting, like, literally right there, like, clapping. And I, I wish I knew what he was thinking in that moment, like, how do they let that idiot up on stage? Um, that was like, I don't know what your question was, but I wanted to brag about you. <laughs> <laughs>